What's up you guys? My name is Cecily. Welcome to a new video. Today is going to be like a rapid fire. I'm not going to go super into detail about each and every piece that I'm showing you. It's going to be just a video of some fall essentials, basics that I got. Starting with this first piece right here. This is a knit sweater, long sleeve with the hole for the thumb. This is from Arquette and I wanted something that's tight fitting to the body and the color brown because I wear a lot of creams, off-whites, so brown really pairs beautifully with that. And then I also got this coat. This is from Uniqlo and this is a cream coat. It is something in between. I would say it's not quite a winter coat but it's not like your typical trench coat either, which is like synonymous to fall. It is something in between, super cozy. It's not too long, so if you don't want to do like a super long dramatic coat, which is like more towards colder months, winter, then you can do something like this that's in between. It doesn't have a belt, but it does have buttons, so you can button it up. It has like all the essential things, the, the pockets, it's a beautiful color that you can wear with pretty much everything. So if you already have like a trench coat and you have your wool coat for winter, this is like a beautiful addition that's like something in between. All right, for a monochromatic moment, this is it right here. This is also from Uniqlo. It is a very nice sweater with a polo neck. And sometimes it's details like this that make just a regular sweater just a little bit more elevated so you know you have a collar you can i don't know it just feels a little bit more chic than a regular crew neck sweater and sweaters like this i wear all the time like every single day if it's cold i'm inside working from home whatever i'm wearing a sweater if i put like this coat over it it's just the winter whites but these are the fall creams <laughs> but so 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 beautiful if you're head to toe in just one color or like at least the same shades but then different materials i just love the play on that and yeah i mean how sophisticated does this look you can dress this up or down put heels on or wear it with sneakers and then just go about your day all right shocker here is another sweater this is from massimo duty and it's actually a cardigan but i love to wear cardigans like this just closed up and tucked in it has very nice and long sleeves that you can pull up if you want the trousers are from frankie shop i highly recommend these trousers they are like my best pair of trousers in my wardrobe i did have to get them tailored though and then i also have this coat this coat is also from uniqlo it's like from a special line that they launched and i was debating between this one and the cream one but this one is more of a proper kind of coat, but it's still very lightweight. I think this coat is beautiful and I actually like this one better than the cream one. However, I like the cream color better than this gray color. So I have to kind of decide which one to keep and which one I will get the most amount of use out of. But this is just beautiful. I mean, look at the cut. It, the length is just perfect. And you have like a belt to cinch in the waist. It's nice and soft. It's like the same kind of material as the cream one. All right, this is another coat, but it's super, super lightweight. It's not really a puffer cut, but I would say like a padded coat. And this is like more of a raincoat, but I would say a little bit more stylish. Like some raincoats can be just ugly. And this will keep you dry. It doesn't have a hood though, but other than that, it will keep you dry. And it is a little bit more stylish. It has like these pool thingies on the inside to give it a little bit more shape. And it reminds me of the padded coat of frankie shop you guys know that coat is like on my wish list i've tried a similar style from arquette before that style comes really really close to the one from the frankie shop i'll link it below just for reference but this one is a great option as well and at a better price point it's a navy color it is a very long so like you can say maxi length and it has like these little buttons right here so you can close it up and it's like i said very very lightweight so you can do all your 
outdoor activities and something like this. All right, this is a very essential piece. This is a cashmere sweater from Uniqlo. The previous one, the cardigan from Massimo Dutti was also from cashmere. It's just like once you try cashmere on your skin, you can't really go back. Like there is something about it, how soft it is, how it falls on the body, all the things. So this is like a very basic essential fall piece for me. But then I have two trench coats that you guys will have to help me with i am looking for a navy trench coat because i already have like the olive green like khaki and the just regular brown classic brown trench coat color but i'm missing something navy so i have two options one is also from uniqlo and this one is from abercrombie and just at the weight of both this one from Uniqlo is more heavyweight. The design is pretty much the same, but I'll just try them both on side by side so you can see what they are like. So the verdict is in. <laughs> I definitely think that the one from Uniqlo is better made, better materials, and just a more beautiful design in general. This one from Abercrombie has that, you know, that noisy kind of material that's water resistant. So that's like a good thing for sure about a trench coat. I'm not sure if this one from Uniqlo is water resistant because it's 100% cotton, but I think it has like a coating on it. I'm not, don't quote me on that, but it does feel a little bit water resistant. Also this one from Abercrombie is more lightweight. It doesn't have a lot of shape and I don't know, it just looks a little bit cheaper than this one from Uniqlo. So if you're looking for something that's like very very casual like just to maybe walk your dog or now that i have a dog i'm only using that example but <laughs> if you want to run errands things like that this trench coat is perfect for that but if you want something that's a little bit more on the dressy side of things i mean you can definitely see from the structure of this trench coat you know the way that the collar stays up this definitely has more structure and substance to it in my opinion so if you're looking for something like that then definitely go for this one from uniqlo i also love that the lining has like a, this beautiful pattern on it you can see a little bit of the pattern peeking through when you walk and the trench coat is open so that's like you know those little details make a piece very special so yeah this is a beautiful beautiful piece for sure so that concludes the video i really hope that you saw some you know essentials some basics here and there to fill in the gaps of your fall wardrobe and i'll have more videos of like styling fall outfits coming very very soon so stay tuned subscribe let's get to that 100k this year and i'll see you in my next one bye